Three minutes past six o'clock now. New from overnight, a driver loses control of his car and ends up in someone else's garage. And now one man is stuck with a big mess to take care of this morning. And Brooke Moore is live in the newsroom with details of this exclusive interview for us, Brooke. Well, in a matter of hours, Richard Hudson will be heading to work, but he might be carrying some disappointment. You know, I got about, I got years of work in that truck, and he's sitting on top of it right now. You can't even tell there's another vehicle in there. But as you can see, there is another vehicle there. The white one belongs to Hudson. And at around 1 a.m., he was working on installing a new radio. But within minutes of going inside, Hudson says he heard the house's windows shaking. And that's when he went outside to find this blue truck in his garage. The driver had lost control, slamming into Hudson's car and a truck that he had been working on. Police were called on the scene here in the 200 block of Compton Street in Dayton just a short time after. We spoke with Hudson, who tried to stay positive, saying it could have been a lot worse. Yeah, he came about uh, not even a foot away from my house. He destroyed my mailbox. Uh, my kid sleeps in the front room, you know, on that front wall. But uh, it's a brick house. It's solid. And according to Hudson, that driver lives in the neighborhood, and he is being charged with failure to control and reckless operation this morning. The police are still investigating what caused him to crash. Reporting live, I'm Brooke Moore. Two news on your side.